What's going on guys, it is Welsh Dragon DSC here and welcome back to another Blackburn Rovers career mode. Today guys, we have got a transfer deadline today special because we had quite a lot of negotiations go on last episode and everything was just happening. It was like, oh my god, I don't know what's going to happen. So we're going to be doing that today. We're going to go through all the transfer negotiations, sell players, reject players and transfer deadline day is going to happen. But one of the big things is now, before we jump into our six six players that we are looking to sign Mr. Joe Lucre links in the description use my discount code to get yourself 10% off but we look at all these players so we were mainly looking at left back right back um, right mid and that's it so this is one of the main players Hendricks who was looking to bring in Marcus Edwards was like a little bonus sign as well 700 grand can't go wrong but we don't necessarily need him Roberts was a replacement back a back at player Hendrick was another player as well, but he wants 15 grand wage. Here's another one as well, Bree. And also then, we're looking to bring in Burke. So, first signing, we're going to be signing Hendrick. Right, for 1.5 million. Not too shabby in my opinion. But this is... I've, oh, uh-oh. I've just done this. Actually, do, will it be adjusted? Yes, it will be adjusted. Burke is going to be joining us as well. And now this is a big one. We need the right back. We only got we got two right backs. Five hundred grand, six hundred grand. But this guy's got higher potential. So hopefully that should be able to adjust, and we will be signed. What? Don't have enough budget. How? How don't we have enough budget to? So we need six hundred grand and a thousand to sign that player. How is that? How is that not even possible? I thought I thought we had that. I generally thought we had that. Let me go to budget. Guys, we just hit that like button, guys. I want to say thank you very much for all the players you suggested. We look, we are at the million pound profit. Like, give me my money, <laughs> honestly. But we got two new signings: Burke and Hendrick. Sixty-seven rated. Oh, he ain't gonna be starting with that with John, is he? And then we got Burke, who is simply just going to probably slot in. Actually, he's not going to start either. Uh, we're going to sell Liam Feeney. We're going to sell Liam Feeney. And we're going to see if we can. We need a right back. We literally don't have a replacement right back. For the left back, we did. We did have a replacement left back. But we didn't have a replacement right back. I made a bit of an error there. But we shouldn't have done. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to my sell players. And we're going to sell Liam Feeney. Actually, let's just use. Feeney is trying to listen, but nobody wants him, and so is Evans. Need to get rid of him. McCartan's not for transfer. So, let's have a look who we purchased this season. Obviously, McCartan, we already signed. But look, already we've signed. Burt, we've just signed as well. Hendricks, we've just signed it also. And also, Silva, we've signed, uh, which is the ones that we purchased. So, we purchased four main players to our side. So, right back, left back, centre mid, and a goalkeeper, because Feeney Bob wanted to leave. But we've got quite a lot of players out on loan. Liman, Tomlinson, Nibi, uh, Mahoney, uh, Laura, Ray has loaned out as well. Um, then we got Bell, who's loaned out. Then we got Wharton. Oh, he's still on our side. And more, we got in on a two year loan with an option to buy, just so you know. So you, we've got the option to buy a three million. So at the moment, we need his value to double within two years for us to actually sign him. And then also we've got Gallagher on a one-year loan. We'll consider signing sign him in the future to see how he does. And then we've got the rest of our players here. And obviously we've signed Oxford last year and stuff like that. Boas we signed last year. Abraham we signed last year and stuff. Um, but yeah, this is... I really need those two to sell. Big time. Just need an offer and I'll have enough to accept any offer that comes in for him. Because we do need a right back position. So it is a bit of a, a big, big... Well, I'm trying to say deadline date is literally coming. Transfer offer coming in. Oh, tell me, Abraham, I'm not going to sell him, am I? Let's be honest. If you give me 15 mil for him, you can have it. Right? Because he's not actually that good. But 15 mil, you can have him. Here we go. Corey Evans has been offered. We're going to set that 475,000. Literally, me like straight up, you can go. Tammy Abraham, we're going to reject that off. I don't understand why Tammy Abraham is suddenly getting loads of offers. Like, if, to be fair, he scored on his debut in the Premier League. 
That's probably a reason why. But if we can sell um, Corey Evans now, we can bring in our right back that we really, really need. And transfer down line day, day this year. Player sold. There it is. I don't think that's enough. Is it enough? I actually don't think it is. We only need a grand. No! Oh my god! We literally need 200 pounds! Oh, never! Oh, we need 200 pounds to sign Bree. I really want Edwards. We're not, we're 105 pounds short to sign in Bree. Oh my god, really? Is this what it's going to come to? Oh, have I got that little bit extra money for Corey Evans? Transfer offer, I don't think he's worth that much. Obviously, he's 15 million, I asked you to pay for him. Oh my god. August 31st, is that right? Oh, we ain't, we ain't going to sign him. Damn it. Transfer Tommy A. Right, I'm not going to sell Tommy Abraham, am I? I'm not going to sell him. I've just bought him. He's 73 rated. He's 19 years old. Are you soft? I mean, I think I'm going to sell him for 15, uh, for 5 million. Oh, my God. Liam Feeney. Here we go. Liam Feeney and go. Oh, right. Get out of here. Liam Feeney and go. Liam Feeney and go. Even though we kind of do need him. But... I'm, oh, God. I, we do need him. We need him. Oh, man. I made some bad decisions today. I made some really bad decisions. Right. Let's go transfer negotiations and let's sign Bree. What? Oh, my God. Bree's been cancelled. Oh, my days. No. No. Mate. Why? Why are you doing this to me? Oh, there we go. 900 quid. Critical. Important first team player. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. I offered him a grand, didn't I? I offered him a grand. Go. I want you in my team. Come on, Bree. Bree, this is transfer deadline day. What a signing. Oh, this is so not transfer deadline day material, is it? Let's be truthfully honest. Signing freaking Bree from Barnsley. Um, It's not exactly... Is he going to accept? There it is. He's accepted. Bam. We've signed, signed Bree. Just so you know, he's got a potential of like 80. Something down low signs, which is nice. And what is now? I've just noticed we've got quite a nice bit of budget left. 700 grand. That's not too shabby, if I'm truthfully honest. Because what we can do is actually uh, focus in on our uh, youth then. Which is actually pretty good. Um, we're going to reject that because we need Wharton in our side because he's going to be a uh, replacement striker. Um, defender, even, I should say. Breeze in our team. We'll have a look at all our final transfers and stuff very, very soon as well after this transfer deadline day finishes. Two hours left. Uh, nothing is happening for us now. I'm going to have a quick look. I'm going to show you before this ends. Obviously, not all of them in there. We've sold quite a lot of players. We've bought quite a lot of players. I'm going to show you all very, very close details. So Gallagher, Moore, Silva, uh, Lugarets, um, 84 million. Oh, that's Chelsea. I was like, when did Crystal Palace spend 84 million? I was like, whoa. <laughs> but uh, anyway, right. So what we're going to do, we're going to have a quick look at um, all our final transfers and stuff like that. But uh, the C transfer negotiation successful, unsuccessful. Let's have a quick look. So join the club. So, we've had quite a lot of players. We had a total of five who departed the club. But we brought in Gallagher again on a one-year loan. And potentially consider actually signing him. And he does only have one year, one year left on his contract. So, he could get him for free. And then we got more as well. We are looking to try and sign on a contract at the end of the year. So, he is on a two-year loan. But at the end of the two years, we've offered three million for him. And we're going to pay three million for more. Which I think is actually quite a cracking deal. All right, we brought in for 1.3 million. Quite a good sign in four years. 12 grand wage. Cannot go wrong. Silva, we bought for 1 million. 
Uh, five years, 20% bonus. And then we brought a brand new left back, Henrix. And we brought a new right back in Bree with around 675,000. We paid 600 grand for him. Burke as well, we brought in for right mid. A very good player that we we are looking to use. 3 million, we bought him. Years estimate around 2.7 million, which is not too good, <laughs> if I'm truthfully honest. Um, but then we got Atpan has been sold. Leah's gone on loan. Evans has been sold. Feeney's been loaned, uh, sold. And then Bell has been put on a one-year loan deal as well. So this is what we're going to do now. We are actually going to be focusing on our youth team. Um, oh, I'm not going to offer any of these a contract. Look at that. It's absolutely terrible. What I'm going to do, I'm going to set up a scout network. Are we actually going to set up a scout network for defenders? Which I think is quite crucial for us right now. I think defense is quite our main priority, um, to be honest. So I'm thinking, like, Emmanuel, I kind of do want to drop Emmanuel. So there we go. We change that up. We got, we'll tie the side up now, actually. Let's do it quite now. I always tie my side up. I always make it nice and uh, make it all quite slick. Michael Roas, you can jump back and start. Um, technically, oh, actually, Burke's played. Arnold's 74 rated. So. I'm not gonna leave. I'm gonna leave it like that. So we're gonna put Tammy Abraham back in front. More so, gonna be starting just because I just no, he's not been doing well whatsoever. Um, but anyway, that's this is our main starting eleven. This is this is what we're gonna be going out with. Breeze jumping straight in there um, with 80 odd potential, so I think he's gonna do pretty well for us. And um, Manuel's probably gonna be fighting for his place, but we do need the depth. If I'm honest, we're in the Euros. Um, in Europa League, even I say the FA Cup, the League Cup, and everything, so it's quite a lot going on. So let's have a look at let's jump into my office and let's jump into my youth staff. And we're actually going to hire a scout for quite a lot of budget. Um, 382, who's better, English or Swedish? We're going to go with Tyler Wilson. Oh, actually, Matt Martinson sounds like he's pretty good. So we're going to sign him. Um, and what we're going to do, we're going to set up a scouting network in Scandinavia, essentially. I oh, know. Scotland, North Russia, Norway. I'm going to send him to Spain. Yeah, no, they send him here. See if we can get some Belgians or something. Um, yeah, see if we can get some Belgians. We're going to put him out there for six months. And we want to look for... Who does, who does good defenders? I'm trying to think about really solid defenders. Um... Defensive minded, attacker, goalkeeper, right, we're going to say defensive minded, so we send backs. Um, Belgians, have they got good defenders? Belgians got decent defenders. Company, Batongan, French, French got this. Let's see if they got any, let's go France. I'm going to go, I'm going to get some French players. Germany, oh, Germans. Let's get some German defenders. <laughs> Here we go, we're going to put them out there for nine months. Defensive minded player. And we're going to see how well he does. He's got a free star. And we're going to set up a scout net with a tailor as well. Um, he's going to be focusing in the English leagues. Uh, we're going to put him out there for nine months as well. And to be honest, we've got two small strikers. Midfielders. Do I want midfielders? Um, let's look for a technically gifted. Yeah, it's up for technically gifted. Oh, we don't have enough to complete the move. Technically gifted. Three months. Three months today. So he's gone out for three months. And then he's out in Germany for nine months. Finding us some defenders that we can potentially use. And what I'm actually going to do. I'm going to give myself a youth um, player as well. That I can bring in. And so hopefully it's a, a defender that will offer us. And also never connected to the EA service. It's always down. And it's really, really irritating. So fingers crossed we can... Uh, we can connect. So let's do this. That's um, been talked about in that, like, um, what do you call it? Financial takeover. I'm thinking season three, we'll consider doing that. I got a feeling that'll be something we do in season three. But anyway, I'm going to send forward just quite briefly to see if the scout goes out. The FA Cup, uh, FIFA World Cup qualifiers. Um, let's have a look. This is, yeah, scout has been dispatched. So we've got one coming up there. And then we got T. Baker and Martinson. He's going to be out as well. So we've got quite a lot of youth. That's going to be our main focus, I think. Um, and then, guys, that's the end of this episode. So next episode, we've got quite a lot of games uh, coming up. We've got 
West Ham we're going to be playing. We've got, uh, I don't know who they are. we got Not in the Forest as well. So we've got quite a jam-packed episode. Um, but we did end up beating Sweden and we lost to Belgium uh, in that. But anyway, guys, that's the end of this episode. So, so I want to say thank you very much for watching. Hope you all did enjoy. Final scout report. How good is Henrik? Is he, is he a decent player? 68 rated as well. He's actually pretty good. We'll keep him on our books. We'll keep him on our books. And Orpha, 73 rated. He would have been such a good signing. But unfortunately, we didn't sign him. But anyway, play conversations. Upcoming match. So, guys, my name is Welsh Shiny SG. Make sure you hit that like button. Do not forget to subscribe. I want to say thank you very much for all your support. And make sure you check out Loot Crate and check me out on Twitter, Welsh Shiny SG. And also check out my Blackburn Rovers Twitter at Talk Blackburn. So, thanks for watching. My name is Welsh, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. Woo! I do it for the love, for the love, yes I do So you don't care about the money, well yes it's true And I'm so blessed to be fulfilling my destiny All material things could mean less to me Only thing I ever could need is a Sarah B Sample with a dope ass beat And get the mic check, all the levels right